show you. I, I just hope I can sing, but I can't sing. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, you know what I have, who I have in the studio. He goes by the name Olua Show. He's from Elijah Ogun State. Yes, I know. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the studio. Shantizo. Oh, yeah, Shantizo, you, there was a time you were Shandiba. Oh, well, I'm still Shantizo. <laughs> <laughs> that, were, I mean, the AKA is there. The AKA is there. Shantiba, Shant everything. Shandela. Shandela. Shantizo. Shantizo. Shant anything. Shant anything. And Shant for the bitch. How has Shantizu been doing? Yeah, been okay. Bro, she yeah. don't, everything don't hard though. She's here yeah, from... The ministry don't grow up. The ministry has <laughs> been moving to permanent side. So what's been happening? Uh, it's been a while. It's been a while. But when I say a while, it does not mean you've not been doing things. Yeah, I see right. you keep dropping videos, yeah, keep right, dropping sure. the videos, and we couldn't get enough of all that. <laughs> so how has the journey been for you? Uh, well, so far, I just want to thank God and thank my friends for supporting me from day one. So far, the journey's been great. It's been wonderful. Mm. So... Now, success story, Shia, by the Success way. story, success <laughs> story, success story. It, it, the interesting thing about the music you do is you've always got songs for different people different. at every point in time. Mm -hmm. um, a good number of them, a lot of them <laughs> were, but a good number of them, Loki, Loki, mm -hmm. Perfect, Perfect, Perfect Gentleman was always a special request for me. Yeah, it's, it's, it's evergreen and it's still evergreen, banging today. And I, I tell like you, that. I think if a lot of people could always put up an evergreen song at Sometimes any point, like of course, that. you have to do the party banger, mm -hmm. but there should be the evergreen, the evergreen concept. Songs, yeah. So let me take you on Perfect gentleman first okay. they will not go to uh, you have a lot and of course <laughs> i just hope i hope we stay a day like this we're supposed to have a dedicated one hour show with you. I'll, I'll but of course we're still going to stay that definitely, this definitely. is just to let you know that we are that coming, back coming. On you. so perfect gentleman what went into that song uh first uh first of all i want to thank the teams for putting together that beat uh, and so that time we're working on the album the journey album okay that came out 2014 i guess yeah and uh, after recording so many songs, even Perfect Gentleman was the last song recorded on the album mm. and was the first track on the album. Wow. Uh, Tunes was in London. I think he went to see his girlfriend, you know, for a while. I think about a month. And he came back, you know, it's like, okay, this song I want us to do. Probably, you know, the love thing was, you know, shocking and yeah. all that. So, and that was how we came up with the song. And we're in the studio going back and forth. And uh, he was like, let me be your fan. So, really? That you have that, like an idea. I'm like, okay, cool, let's make it happen. Then we start, you know, putting everything together. Mm. So it could be said that, that song was dedicated to. Us. Maybe it was dedicated to his girl. <laughs> okay, I just said it that way. I like was dedicated to. Okay, so I'm sure um, for any lady that mm -hmm. song, for any lady that song is dedicated to. Should for every know? female out there, for every beautiful female out there, that song is for them. Yeah. So what was the response like when that song? That dropped it was even the first uh, since it was the first song on the album. So. The attraction was like, you know, all the way. Because I, I used to have this auntie, you know, like a very close friend of mine, but I see her as like, as an auntie, so. The auntie, and auntie. it was, yeah, auntie. <laughs> <laughs> auntie. <laughs> so then he, he, she called me, she was like, okay, boy, first track, yeah, bango, we mm. like it, you know, she likes it. Even her husband likes it. I was like, okay, yeah, I think we should shoot a video for that. To, you know, songs like Looky Looky 2 was like uh, yeah. a massive hit from the Lucky, album. Lucky, so Lucky we decided to shoot a video videos. for that too. So. And the interesting part of um, some of these songs are that um, the younger ones, mm -hmm. even the younger ones, when they grew up to know this song. To know the song. That's, that's, um, well, I want to thank her for that too. And uh, details for putting so much work in it. Like, uh, most especially Perfect Gentleman. That's, 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 that's evergreen. Like, I still perform that song like every wedding. Like, since 2014 and it's still banging today and you, there's no wedding you go to that you won't play perfect gentleman mm. you know everybody be like, ah. be like it was this wedding i went to like last week and uh when the song was playing the uh the bride yeah mm -hmm. her father came out and she was like ah oh my dad oh my dad oh my dad Oh, mommy, oh, mommy, oh, mommy, oh, that, that. Oh, no. was, was he spraying the money or spraying the money? <laughs> it was spraying me the money for Just singing. Where's where oh, the money? Let's <laughs> share the money. <laughs> Definitely, you should me. I can't do this. So, interesting. That means um, Perfect Gentleman yeah, was, yeah. was really bad. And mm -hmm. a lot of other songs you do. I, I, I'm yeah. a very strong fan of Thank the songs. Kilo B, Komole. And it's obviously interesting. Somehow, you don't just have evergreen songs. You have evergreen songs. There was a time I was doing a compilation of um, new school, mm -hmm. and old, old school, school songs. You understand? I found out that we couldn't just go away, take away mm -hmm. from them. We were able to take the likes of Two Fe, Two Baba, and Definitely. Little Wife, or mm -hmm. we took sure. Komole, and this thing kept coming. Come yeah, coming. And the thing is, I was watching a movie sometime, and I was actually watching with a friend of mine, a uh, Western movie where you have mostly white people, and from the soundtracks, and I heard a song. I was like, ah, "Which song do this one?" So I brought up my phone, 
you know, clicked on Shazam or what they call Shazam, it. So like, Shazam. you know, we'll be this artist. And the next thing was Majid Fashek. I was like, for real, that was my first time. Wow. I was like, ah, Majid Fashek, can I can a Nigerian person do this job? No. Oh boy, make a note in the single. <laughs> That's when you actually yeah, said, I was like, and back then, Nigerian artists were moving from one record label to another, right. like right. one big international record label to mm -hmm. another. And it's so funny right now when they say the so called son is signed you, and everybody's so crazy about this thing, has been happening mm -hmm. a long time. Then yeah. we're moving from one big record label to another. To so another. I don't know why it could be like, say, you know. And interestingly, I'm, I'm also glad that you have been part of that journey yeah. along the line. So um, now, Difference Entertainment, yeah. Tizu Nation. <laughs> I need you to talk about that. Yeah, I don't understand. Difference Entertainment. So uh, what was, what's up with Difference Entertainment even now? Oh, well, that's that's my brother. That's the family label right there. Okay. You know, and... Uh, I'm glad you stayed this long there. I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm yeah, yeah, yeah. It was for, it was for three years there. and, you know, and after the album, after the contract I had to like you know move on okay. and open my own record label because so was moving forward on difference or on Tizu Nation, oh, Tizu Nation. Mm -hmm. the journey was on was difference on yeah. so I was like back then oh, with difference right. yeah it was good uh, so far and you can tell that's why we're here today for that sure. was like the genesis the genesis, genesis. shout out to different entertainment mm -hmm. shout out to D teams for you know taking the bold step and everybody that will work there are just you. few of people like you that could start uh, with a good respect and a good oh boy, and a shout and out to them a whole lot of them even to my manager to my publicist johnson rico like everybody we started together and we're still together till then yeah. before we move or oh, we're going to move on to the moving forward um, okay. I'm, I'm going to get take it back quickly around the journey the journey album, album. you did a lot of other songs how, <laughs> how is it for you how easy was it for you releasing videos i got a lot of your videos online I got Jalulu. Oh I'm still coming back to Latin. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going back to Latin. Oh boy. And since now the work now, I see the drum, it's it's normal you drop a video to like, you know, to the songs, you know, because I think these days when you drop a video to the song, that's when people get to know, okay, you have a new single out. And with the video, it paints like, you know, a visual and something for you to have in mind when you listen to the song. So definitely I should drop a single, drop a video. You see, I could keep going on and on with <laughs> short teaser. And that's what I'm saying that we must just look for definitely. a whole one hour. hour. So I tell you. It's not fun. Yes, let's go check Jalolo video by short teaser. When we're back, I'm going to continue within the time frame we have. <laughs> Still being intimidated by the very own Shantiz, but of course I'm keeping it low key. I'm doing fine. And um, the interesting part of this are guys. I hope Shantiz is going to go on stage one of these days. Shantiz is a satellite graduate from University of Galway, Premier University. So I'm sure you're going on stage one of these. Yeah, 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 yeah. 2015, I did a movie with. Uh, yeah, oh, called that straight. Yeah, what's that? Hope it, wasn't, hope it wasn't a Playboy single. It was a Playboy scene. Oh, like, you know, I thought as much. <laughs> juggling between two girls, mm. you know, having the real love and having the other woman supplying with, you know, funds to, mm. you know. Mm. So it was, it was a good movie. I've not seen it myself, okay. but I heard okay. like it's a good movie. Like I was on Snapchat someday, wow. and uh, uh, my girl sent me a video of somebody seeing the movie. And the person was laughing with a whole lot of their low hair. Like, you know, I was like, yo, I need to see this movie. Interestingly, I saw the trailer of the movie mm -hmm. just like three to three, four days ago. Days ago. And I had to be asking myself, was that Shantizu? Was that <laughs> so, no, no. <laughs> so I, I, I saw that coming. So it tells me that that is yeah. the, for, for the likely opening door for acting. acting yeah, and definitely. you're also looking into that line. Definitely, definitely. Now, Shantizu, you would agree with me that you've been in this industry for quite a while. <laughs> Something has kept you staying. This is an industry <laughs> where people go and come. Oh, you see yeah, somebody, ah, do you just remember this person? Mm -hmm. But... Interestingly, we spoke on the Evergreen song sure. that will still keep you in the heart of the mm -hmm. world. Something that kept you staying. You kept dropping them, you kept releasing them, you kept it's being in the heart of the fans. Well, me, I want to say this God, though. I won't lie to you, man. Because even the so called Evergreen song, sometimes after recording the songs, I'll be like, ah. is that, is when I get to listen to it, and I'll be like, oh boy, I'll person, what do you really think where they're doing this? What's on you your mind? You know, and, and the reception, too, you know. So uh, I can't really say it's me, but I just want to thank God. God. So going back to Jalulu, what inspired this song? And I was going to ask you the <laughs> meaning. I was going to say Jalulu. Oh, I was going to say Jalulu. Yeah. <laughs> and then they talk and say, what would they grow up now? And all the songs where they sing for studio. Oh, yeah, right. Jalulu, Jalulu. What's that they talk and call them? Get one the way they call them. Yeah, get one kind of way they call them. I know if you don't know what we're growing up, actually. You know, this, you just know rhymes, story, just all these rhymes, rhymes and, up, and all that. So, you know, and I decided to just, you know, put in a song. 
you, you know, uh, another song that struck me like that, you know, those song, those yeah. titles kept putting us in mystery was when I heard a song by Gibraltar for Lionel, it was Alan Terry. Okay. I reminded me of growing yeah, up, Alan like Terry, you know, those songs. <laughs> so, interestingly, um, Jalolo, I've seen Thank You too. Yeah, I think yeah. those are one yeah, of the uh, uh, latest uh, works. Forward, um, a Ruku Shahik boy. Yeah, that was and 2015 as well. Two, 2015. 15 and it's still banging. It's still November banging. November 2015. 15. Yeah. A Ruku Shahik boy. Yeah. I, I'm a Yoruba man and Definitely. I know what a Ruku Shahik boy is. Mm-hmm. What's the word? Every year there goes banger. Bam. Ever so I take you to Latin lover now. Yeah, that's the one. So was someone falling in love with a Latin babe or something? Tell me about Latin lover. What is the latest one? We're just being creative. Because <laughs> <laughs> when I was working on that, it was supposed to be an album. So when I was working on the album and I told Black, that's the Black Jersey, the producer, I said to him, like, yo, with this album, I want us to have different sound, like, from salsa to whatever, whatever, to dance or to, let's have different sounds. So, so sound. it was an album, it was supposed to be an album, and we decided to just, you know, drop an EP, and okay. it was just about putting together different sounds, and just being creative. And how's the response been? I yeah, trust, it's been trust. so, I won't lie to you, man, because the video was shot by you and you, and okay. a very talented young guy, too. It's a very clean video. I think that's why too. That's one of the reasons why. Very interesting. Is this, this is a very important aspect I must ask, mm-hmm. and and we understand this aspect because you, just a strong voice in the industry has been. Mm-hmm. Now talking about giving back to the community that have given you so much. How do you want to give back to them? How do I give back to them? Okay, first of all, the music is given back. That's one. Yeah, well, <laughs> and and two, right now, myself and my team are working towards you know giving back. Like I'm actually starting from my hometown, okay. like God's grace on those states. Like yeah, 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 yeah. But well, I'm not just gonna. How far is it like to or what? Well, I don't come know. <laughs> <laughs> God is there. So I come to your city so well. <laughs> yeah, so but we're not just trying to restrict it to Elijah. You know, if we could, you know, expand it and you okay. know. You know, supply water and you know to some school. Basically, we're looking at schools and uh, you know chairs and desk and oh, that's you know just some schools in and my. I'm very really glad you're taking it out of Lagos. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm, I'm Everybody's trying to. You know, I have. You know, we we'll go down for the other side. We believe. We believe it. We believe it. <laughs> it's still been fun talking with Sean. This, uh, I, I, like I said, we're still going to have a dedicated one hour. Now one full day. One full day. If I know you one hour, now one full twenty four hours show. Definitely. This, uh, now I wanted to see Latin lover. When we come back, we're still hanging out live in the studio. Check it out.